Hey everybody, Anne here, and it's my three month anniversary. and today is the first day that Betty went to the pet sitter. So here's how it went. There she is. She made it through her first day at the dog sitter and she is beat. Those kids wore her out. I dropped her off today at about, oh, I wanna say, oops, you're getting too close, girlfriend. I dropped her off uh, around nine o'clock this morning. And uh, I just picked her up. It's, uh, it's like quarter till three right now. And um, there's like five or six, let's see, one, two, three, four, four kids and a teenager. Well, and the, and the grandma and the grandpa. And uh, they offered to watch my, my beautiful girl. And um, so she, she did great. When I walked in, it's like, she could have cared less that I was there. Um, she just loves those kids. She's very good with them. Um, they all love her and it just went really well. So <laughs> she's gonna go back and lay down. She's probably tired now. So I'm just kind of happy. Um, I wish I could turn this camera around. Here, let me see. Let me see if I can just do it this way. Where's the camera? I don't know. I think the cam oh, there it is. Here's the camera. I think it's get, got me on it. I'm not sure. I'm feeling much better today. Um, I only had a couple bouts of, you know, runny tummy and I got some modal, so I'm feeling better. Um, you know what? And I'm, I'm going to finish up my update here in just a bit. Okay. Well, I'm back at the very first place that I kind of, you know, came and stayed day camped when I first moved into this van little over 90 days ago. I'm marking April 1st as my real true first day of van life. And so it is July 8th, so April. I'm doing July three months in a week, basically. Um, it looks a little different now. <laughs> Remember, this was all just a field that was just kind of mowed and there was nothing to it. Now we've got all kinds of wildflowers growing everywhere, all different colors. And, uh, yeah, my uh, solar's up on the roof, getting some free energy. And I'm about ready to take the girl for a little walk. Yes, that's right. Because you were such a good girl at, at uh, the babysitters, the dog sitters. So we're going to go for a little walk. And uh, my phone's probably going to go dead. But I want to see if this area back in there that I like to go for walks in looks any different this time of the year. But man, it sure has changed a lot. Alrighty. Yep, there she is in that same old spot. She needs a washing, that's for sure. I kind of learned to back in a little bit better this time. I'm proud of myself. So let's go check this place out. It's going to be shady and cool in the middle of all that. Oh, it is gorgeous back here. And nice and cool and shady. Perfect place to go for a walk. When I first came here, I had a really hard time making it up that hill. I mean, it just keeps going in and going. And I've lost, stepped on the scale today, lost another 10 pounds, go me. Lost another 10 pounds, so I'm gonna see, let's see if I get quite as winded going up this hill. All right, let's give it a shot. Okay, I've made it to the first well, actually the second little branch. There was one down there, but I like to go to this one because back in here, there used to be a house. See, there's the sidewalk. So, I guess, yeah, right over there. That's where the house used to be. You can still see the foundation. Ooh. A little bit winded, but I'm not doing as bad as I did before. So there was a house back here. Imagine how cool that must have been. Oops, I'm getting bit. Yep, here's the steps. All right, Betty, come on. Come with me. Steps. I guess that was the basement. Look how they did the stones back then. I don't know how old this is. I don't know whose house it is. I would sure like to know. But it's just kind of crumbled over the years. Yep. I don't know, I need to find out who lived here. 
but the trail keeps going back that way pretty far over there and um, this is so far this is the only house the only um, you know ruins that I found back here but I haven't really explored it all that much so who knows maybe I'll find something else it looks like I made it up the hill now I could take this branch and go up a little bit further and you know what I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do I don't think I've ever gone up this edge or this uh, this trail before so let's check it out see what's see what's what okay check this out look at this tree all the way up here I wonder what made it grow like this isn't that weird I mean we got one nodular here then it went this way then it went up hmm 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 I wonder what made it do that weird but look how cool it is back there oh it is so cool it's like something you'd see in a horror movie or you know like a Texas Chainsaw Massacre or something like that <laughs> what do we have here We've got a mushroom. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and pick it and see. That's what it looks like underneath. And then these, ah, 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 Betty, no. Ow! Something keeps buzzing in my ear. It's like caught in my hair. Weird. Sorry about that. I had to get a bug out of my hair. And then these look like they might be oyster mushrooms. What do you think? I don't know. They're not as white as the other ones. Um, let's see what they smell like. Mmm, they smell good. I'm taking these, so y'all gotta tell me what you think they are. I think they're oyster. They could be the chanterelle. I don't know. Let me know. Alright, there are a ton of these mushrooms growing all over the place. They look real similar to the ones that I showed you before. I don't think these you can eat, so I'm not even going to mess with them. All right, we went around about half of the area. Look at that cool field. Um, and there's a shack out there somewhere. Where's it at? Way over there. I don't know if you can see it. Next time I come here, we're going to go out there. I hope, I hope you can get there. But you know what? This has been a really nice little walk. I just love this place. I need to come here more often. Yeah, so, oh, and this is the same place that that weirdo lady took pictures of my license plate. <laughs> Probably thought I was a creeper. But, um, okay guys, well, thanks for coming on this little nature walk. Feeling a lot better today. Having a good day looking at the pretty flowers. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.